So we're here with Nano Vivo. And uh, what are we looking at here? Hi. Hi, I'm Jeff McCubbin with Nano Vivo. We're a young startup in, here in Silicon Valley. And we've developed the world's first wearable monitor, wrist monitor for health and wellness factors like so what it, hydration, collagen, fat, antioxidants, protein. So all this is and using non-invasive blood chemistry monitoring. And our software analyzes these. So uh, you are non-invasive, but you are monitoring the blood chemistry. How does that work? Mm -hmm. oh, it just uses light to go into the bloodstream and analyze the reflections back. And it's the world's first. And it's this kind of a low, low key announcement. So it sends the light and monitors it here, or where? How does it, where, it, where, it what's going on here? It, it measures reflect, reflections back from the bloodstream, and then the software analyzes these contents that are very important to people's health and wellness and fitness. And it empowers the individual to take control of their health. So, um, how did you develop this? How did you make it happen? We, we have the engineers on staff to do it, and we're a young startup, and we recognize the need for this. So, do you have a connection right now? Yeah, well, I can yeah. show you how one works. We have, we have an app on the iPhone called Nano Vivo. Yeah, so it's connected with their Bluetooth? And, and the blue light shines when it has the Wi-Fi connection. And then you, we have three, in this application we have three, hydration, protein, and fat. So we'll measure, it'll show us hydration first. And it says I'm at 52, which is very well hydrated. It saves the other ones. Protein is at 19, fat 1.9. So those are pretty good numbers. I'm, I'm doing pretty good today. So is this uh, accurate? Yes. Like how accurate is this? Well, the purpose of us bringing this out today and rolling this out, it's a low key rollout, but it's is to show industry and other technical organizations th this capability and how it can help them sell their products or services. So we're here to try to uh, get to talk to other organizations that might want to collaborate with us or form strategic partnerships. And you can put this technology into other smartwatches? Yeah, yeah we, can, we can team with any other companies that have sensors or sensing devices this is a good adjunct to other products as well so so we're, we're here opening up to other companies for you know talks about partnering so your product is a sensor is mm -hmm. a beam it's, it's machine a, yeah. what is it it's, uh, it would be termed a spectral sensor so the sensor that's your product using and color yeah spec spectrum looking at the spectrum Nice, and uh, there's a, a microcontroller and stuff going on in the this prototype right now. Yes. But it could be paired up with all kinds of other. Mm -hmm. Sure. And uh, this could be just one of the sensors in a smartwatch. Right. Or, and how soon? What's next? As soon as uh, how fast can as it soon get as out? we develop some partnerships and talking to other companies who uh, want to team up with us to help get this into the, the hands of the consumers where it belongs. It can go fast. Oh yeah, very fast Wi-Fi. You, you could even send send the data to your doctor to you know. Is it that? Is go. it going to be easy enough to mass product mass produce this yes, one? Yes, yes. So mass production is. Yes, we're a young startup. That's why we want to talk to other companies. And what's the price going to be for that kind of sensor? Is that it going to be, be expensive up, or not yeah, so much? That's, it's going to be would, affordable for every every that's, consumer. That would be the goal. Yeah.